Hello, this is Lance Johns. I want to talk about Treasure Island. They plan on over the May 15th. I'm not sure what's going to happen, but that's what they plan to do. Treasure Island is planning to open its doors to guests May 15th, even though Steve Sisolak, governor, said Wednesday that the shutdown... Well, the shutdown is supposed to end April 30th. But he, he said it's going to be extended past April 30th. But the probably uh, website says the Hotel Casino, uh, by, by the order of the governor's office, well, by the order of the governor's office, it's closed, but it's supposed to open uh, May 15th, excuse me, May 15th, a hiccup. That's right now. Treasure Island's spoke woman, uh, yeah, spoke woman, Jennifer Renzelman, said no matter what, we are adhering to the gov- governor's official recommendations. We are working to with vendors to pr- procure appropriate saving safety and sanitation measures, which is why we move our 10th day from May 1st to May 15th. Website also said that this clo- closure is scheduled to last from May 14th and subject to change. Since like has not publicly stated when casino shutdown will be lifted. Some other trip hosts are already at such a reservation in May, but they are announcing reopening dates. Since like told Las Vegas Review Journal on Wednesday that the state will not, <clears throat> well, they won't know when to start counting down the 14 day time frame or declining. See, 19 cases of hospitalizations is that his health advisors must occur before any restrictions are lifted. We have not stated a downward trajectory. I can't give you that day, since Lex said, but I can tell you for certain that some of the directives will. We have to be extending. We are clearly going to be opening up any game. We are not, we are clearly not going to be opening up any game establishment and some other business. We're going to have to continue with the social distance and the avoidance of large group gatherings and whatnot, regardless. Treasure Island website said that the resort will work with all guests who wish to change or cancel their reservations and provide full refunds to those who arrive days during the closure, and that will be monitored on an ongoing situation and follow the advice of federal, state, and local government and health agencies, other operators. It's a Thursday. Uh, Hmm. Okay, uh, this is other, uh, people, this is other casinos. Cause yeah, I was wondering, okay, as of other operators, as of Thursday, MGM Re- Resorts International website was a subject reservation beginning May 1st for a lot of properties. Company spokesman Brian Ahern did not immediately respond to a request for a comment. Caesar Boy, Caesar Entertainment Corporation, Boy Gaming, uh, gaming Corporation and Station Casino was set a uh, reservation for the for the Las Vegas Hotel beginning May 15th. Season spokesman Rich Broom said that that's not a signal the company that we, that we uh, uh, give me uh, that that's a signal that the company will reopen. We when we are allowed to reopen, we want to have a reservation on the books. Broom said we will reopen when allowed to do so by Governor Says that we will continue to adjust our reservation according. Boy Company spokesman David Schro told the Review Journal that the day is tentative and subject to change depending on what future guidelines we will receive from the state. Station Casino spokesman Michael Britt did not immediately respond to a request for comment. Law Vegas saying corporations strip properties, the Venetian Palazzo are not accepting any reservations. Okay, so, I mean, they're accepting reservations, basically, but they're not, they're not, oh, excuse me, they're not for certain when they go open, and the Sands Corporation is not accepting re- reservations. So, hopefully, they will reopen soon, but it probably will be to mid- May, hopefully. But... Let's pray that they will open soon. But like, share, subscribe. Thank you for listening. Be blessed. Be safe. Wash your hands. Stay clean.
Don't don't sneeze and cough if I come in your mouth. Don't be a hoarder. Help people in need. Thank you. Have a good day.